and welcome to the Virtual Groom Room. This is another shaving video for you today, but it's a follow-up from my video yesterday. Um, I did a review of, well, a early impressions of Castle Forbes Essential Oil of Lime. Um, thought it would make sense that I shave with it today. Uh, kind of give my impressions on slickness and cushion, stuff like that. I've got it at the moment, as you can see, loaded in my um, kind of cheapy badger brush. I say cheap, 40 bucks isn't cheap. Like, you can get, you know, the Razor Rock Bruce I have for 15 40 dollars isn't cheap. Although it's cheap for badger, it's still not cheap to me. Uh, the razor I'm using is the good old Rex Ambassador with a Persona Lab Blue. Um, let me get ready with pre-shave and water, and I'll see you in a second. Okay, pre-shave's done. Um, let's get face lathering. <laughs> not, not the best of stuff. So the, the scent of lime is so prominent on your face, like you can really smell it, if I'm honest. Um, I moved my shirt out of the way because very typical of me to get um shaving cream everywhere so tell you what for forty dollars this brush isn't bad I think we'll be okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed through the actual shaving and I will be back at the end of each pass to tell you my thoughts. I'll see you in a minute. Let me rinse off and I'll be back with my opinions. See you in a sec. Okay, so opinions of the Castle Forbes Essential Lime after one pass. It's slick, I'll give it that. As far as the cream goes, I've found soaps tend to have better slickness, if I'm honest. But in terms of a cream, it's one of the slicker creams I've used. Um, the residual slickness uh, before I washed my face was... I'd say moderate, like something you would expect from, I wouldn't say tops because I've had fairly average experience with tops in terms of residual slickness, but the residual slickness was there. I can still feel it a little bit on my face. It's a good cream. Is it $40 worth? I, I actually don't think so. Um, for, it takes a lot for me to justify spending twice the amount of money on excellent performing soaps. Like Soap Commanders, soaps are 15 bucks. 
um, Case Shave Works, 12, 14, 15 bucks. Barrister and Man, like the highest of 18, 19 bucks. It's really difficult for me to kind of justify. I mean, the slickness is still there, but if you can get similar performance out of a soap that's half the price, why wouldn't you, if you understand what I'm saying? I'm going to carry on with the shave. Again, the same format as the first pass. Just going to go through it. I'll give you my final verdict. I'm going to have a two-pass shave today, so I will see you guys after this pass. Let's uh, load up first. Or lather up first. So, it lathers easily. Um, it's very slick. It's so lime. <laughs> Honestly, it's so lime. Cross the grain pass, Castle Forbes line. Let's do it. Okay, that's the second pass done. Um, I'm gonna have a cleanup pass now. I'll be back after the cleanup pass to give you my final verdict. See you in a sec. Welcome back. Um, gone through most of my post shave. About to put uh, the aftershave balm on. So, my verdict. The 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 cream was slick throughout the whole shave. It was, but. Was it slick enough to justify the extra, you know, 20, 25 bucks on top of what you normally buy? No. Um, look, it depends how much money you have at the end of the day. If you have more money than cents, by all means. <laughs> um, I don't. The reason, the reason I bought it was because I had a um, large discount at one of the shops. Um, let's rate everything out of 10, shall we? So, the slickness, I would give an 8. The scent, I would give a 7. The cushion, I would give an 8. In terms of shaving, I, I think you would probably get that from similar, pr from products of a way lower price. Um, hit or miss. I'd say in between hit and miss, because it didn't perform badly, I just think the price is almost unjustifiable. Um, if you want to give it a go, contact me, and if you pay postage, I'll send you a uh, sample. But, um, yeah, you know, I'd be curious to see what you guys think if you've used this so before. Apart from that, it's been Jack, your host from the Virtual Groom Room. I'm very thankful for you guys come along to watch these videos. Uh, the channel is slowly growing, and for that, I appreciate it. Apart from that, it's Tuesday today. Have a good rest of your week, and I'll see you, now, see you guys next time. I have menthol eyes, but apart from that, <laughs> goodbye for now.